fire sign. This is a full moon for March. It is a super, super, super full moon, okay? It is an extremely, extremely super full moon, okay? Extremely. So let's see what is coming up for you, fire sign. Remember, I do the Tarek with the um, moon and sunrise. First, I do the sun and then I do the moon, okay? So sun people and then the general is uh, so don't go away because then you can see what's coming up in all your houses your friendship house your money house yourself what is going to be on uh, um what is going to be happening in your marriage uh, family that sort of a thing okay so 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 all righty mm -hmm. I see the secrets is out for some of you. Secrets about some money. Don't know how that is because it's in the reverse. All right. Okay, so let's um jump in here and see what is coming out for the moon sign remember if you want to see the extended of this video your um your signs um use the link here and this link is um uh, will get you to the extended of this reading use this link okay use this one um to subscribe and use this one to basically um set your notification button on when I am going to be um, um, uploading new videos because if you are a member I upload videos that not everyone's get only for members all right so 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 let's do this let's do this so um, this is for the Sun sign the people who were born between 6 a.m. and 6 p.m. all right it is for the Sun sign so I see some situation with some regret for you fire sign people. So whatever is transpiring, I see regrets for fire sign. I see regrets with a project, whatever that you were doing, whatever that you were transpiring, whatever um, it could be that you were working together with someone. Um, I see you need to protect yourself more, protect your business, protect your information um more fire sign people whatever uh some of you um your business has gone on there i see your wishes and dream is in reverse two nines together um that isn't looking so happily because of some lies and deceptiveness that has transpired okay so there was really some lies and deceptiveness that has transpired so i see your wishes and dreams with your work um whatever that was transpiring um, with your work your business on the work floor lies and deceptiveness and uh, whatever that you were wishing and open for I see this is not going to happen because some deceptiveness at work I see a new start is going to be coming up but some of these people um, that has been that has really gone through a lot of stuff I see the lies and deception where some of you were stabbed in your back and you were stabbed in the back by a Sagittarian whoever the Sagittarian is you were stabbed in your back by a Sagittarian I see a situation where some of you are dealing with an um, Aries uh, with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius or um, this could be a partner or this could be a legal issue um it's not going i see too much lies i see too much lies there is just too much lies i don't know why people lie but i see this investigation is not yet over whatever is transpire i see this investigation is not yet over so some of you could be um having some conflicts um, with a Gemini but the investigation is not yet over I see secrets a lot of secrets secrets about some deceptiveness that has transpired in the past and it's coming in the future um, so um, secret about some deceptiveness that was transpired in the past and it is coming in the future it is coming back because it's as if people um, did this deceptiveness in the past 
and it's coming back so it's vice versa okay it's vice versa but there is a lot of secrets with an aquarian however that is transpiring there is a lot of secrets with an aquarian some of you are dealing with an aquarian and some secrets from um the past is coming back okay so however that is happening to you um some of you i see um um and we're going to be looking at whoever who is uh, deceiving you fire sign people because i see people deceiving especially i see people deceiving you fire sign people and i'm not really liking this i don't know people but i can't take deceptiveness i i i don't know it's just i really really just get so so because i i don't i don't see the reason why people can't be honest okay so fire sign people i see that some of you have some regrets you have the energy of the four of cups you have some regrets and some of you have a regret that you had work on a project or work on a, um a, together with a situation whatever that you have done because now you want a new start but um there's no sight of this new start because it's as if someone and um you know you got in on a deceptive situation with someone and it is now affecting your life okay and you're so upset because you're wondering what if i had never um got connected with this what if i had never got connected with this okay so all right um um the four of cups now the four of cups is the energy of regrets some of you are having regrets dealing with someone on the work floor um that is a cancer because um it can be um but it can be just regrets because um some of you could have dealt with um these water sign people and and now you're seeing jesus i've i've made like the biggest biggest mistake okay but whatever it is i see you're going to be successfully overcoming whatever the deceptiveness is you're definitely going to be um successfully overcoming the de deceptiveness so it has to do with a situation on the work floor and whatever it has been um happening and transpire I see the energy of uh, this is a Taurus, but whatever um, it is and whatever play, I see you are going to be that regret. You're going to be overcoming the regret that has transpired. So we see a situation with work and with your business. Okay. And whatever is transpiring um, with your work, I see you're being very completely clear whatever is transpiring you're opening up you're being extremely completely clear about things um if you're going to be working together with someone and i see um at the end of a cycle and a new beginning is coming in so definitely i see the end of a cycle and a new beginning is going to be coming in so there was just really horrible things that has transpired i see some of you have some regrets and this regrets uh, um could be happening with a situation in the house or at work the lies and the deceptiveness and whatever has transpired i see you're really regretting um you know really connecting um with an endeavor that you could have uh, um worked together with someone and really realizing that uh, um, it was the wrong move that they made. It was just the wrong move that they made. Okay. Um, then, um, I see the nine of ones and I see a new start of love is going to be coming in. I see definitely a new start of love is going to be coming in. However, this is playing out. I see the lies and deceptiveness that has created some burdens around you. It is going to be over now. So, um, whatever that was transpiring, I see some uh, deceptiveness that has created some burdens around you guys and some worries, but this is more as someone stabbed you in the back. Okay. And I see that, um, this worries and deceptiveness is now over. Okay. Um, 
some of you um, young people that had hope and wish for something but it's not going to be happening because your wishes and dreams is in a reverse the nine of cups is in a reverse so whatever that you were wishing and hoping for especially you young people I don't see it's not coming in because I see the energy of uh, um, investigation people seeing the truth of a situation and it's as if uh, um whatever is transpiring the uh, wishes and dreams of getting out of a situation i see you young people are really hoping um that a, a, an issue it could be with a father figure or it could be with your partner um and here is leo sagittarius but this is an older person so it could be a father figure okay if your father is going for surgery i see yes um it is good for this person um to go for surgery and whatever okay so um i see um the energy of the nine of ones i see some of you are dealing with some issue where you're dealing with the energy of the nine of ones that an aquarius gemini or libra has created the nine of ones energy for you however this has come up and has transpired has created the nine of one energies for you now i see and oh god i forget my glasses and i can't get up okay <laughs> so um this is um whatever is transpiring i see that you're going to be overcoming a situation i see the end of a situation with an aries leo or sagittarius so however way this person is coming up and whatever is transpiring and this person is coming up i see um there is a transition of a situation that is um coming up i see the two of cups i see um some of you are dealing with a deceptive partner or some of you are um going uh, there's a deceptive partner or um a deceptive contract that you went in there is a deceptive partner at play or a deceptive contract that you are going in okay i see the message of the page of pentacles where it is as if um some of you have to pay for something i don't see this is going to be happening i see the truth is coming out whatever um was transpiring for um you moon people the truth is coming out i see um that people um however way this is transpiring because i'm seeing an end an end to a situation is coming up it's as if you guys were in like a roller coaster ride and i'm seeing tsunami i'm seeing so much things that is coming in and i see the situation is going to finally finally come to an end because there was so many people with so many different stories of that was going on and on so i see that some of you have to make a decision i see something some deceptiveness and some of you have to make a decision now whatever this deceptiveness is and whatever um this situation is i see that some of you really have to make a decision so as we look at this situation some of you are um there is going to be things coming up with your kids and it's okay whatever is transpiring i see things coming up with your kids but it's going to be okay um it's definitely going to be okay because uh, um you are going to be working out everything and whatever the burdens that you have with your kids because i see some of you regret a situation and you regret a situation where um it could be that your partner has left and you are alone with the kids and you know now you're realizing you can't uh, you know just run to the grocery store because the kids are in the house that's sort of a um, situation and i see you have some regrets some of you have some regrets about a house some of you have some real regrets about connecting with other people um in some um issues and what i'm seeing here is that also some of you wanted um to collaborate and find out uh, like whatever that was transpiring younger people i see that you're going to be um it with a bill okay i see younger people are going to be it with a bill however that comes up is like they're saying younger people 
like 35 and, and younger you're going to be it with a bill however that is coming up so let me know how that went i see um a cancer who have done some really deceptive um uh, situation i see a cancer really a cancer that has done some deceptive situation and you know i've all and and, and now whoever this cancer is that has done this deceptive situation i see the truth is going to be coming out all right the truth is um going to be coming out whatever the issue and the situation is the truth is going to be coming out about the deceptiveness that a cancer has done okay and i see that um um, some information is going to be coming out because I can't say I've done this thing and it's going to come out and I see that some of you are going to be making a decision whether or not you collaborate or work with this person because you're going to realize that this person um, is very deceptive and I, I, I you know in whatever way and however it is coming up I'm not sure you know like which way this person will go because um this person is just something someone that i don't know and 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 i seems to be getting deeper and deeper in something where this person is not letting me know so it could be a client that you have or it could be a friend or it could be someone on the work floor so it's as if this cancer is not being honest because they're going to be finding out some huge deceptiveness from a cancer so um but um it can be a sister it can be a a, a contract that you had taken some huge deceptiveness that has happened and has transpired so however this is coming up and whatever is happening and transpiring they're going to be recognizing um the deceptiveness that has played and whatever has transpired okay so i see here um you know some of you were hoping for a collaboration some of you were open to collaborate with other people but um you know the truth about it is that um, you're going to be finding out that would, that was so much secrets that was kept from you that you're going to be really thinking, you know, I don't know if I should move forward with this situation or these people because uh, I am not seeing clearly what direction they're going. And uh, if I can't see clearly what is happening, I'm not going to make that decision where I could make a decision that is definitely um, going to be um, changing my life in the future. So this is the thing that is coming up. Um, moon signs, so let me know how it is. But whatever the sadness was, I see um, you're going to be healed from this sadness. Okay, whatever the sadness was, I see that you're going to be healed from this sadness. All right, let's look at the moon people. That Those are the people who were born... 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. 6 6 <laughs> 6 a uh, 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. and that is the moon people okay all righty let's see what is coming up fire sign moon people um full moon march super moon for the moon fire sign people what is coming up for you Ooh, la la. okay all righty all right so there's two energies i see um the three of cups in the reverse and i see um the five of pentacles in reverse so there is our chip around you fire sign people and you can see um this art chip really coming up okay it's like you're not happy you fire signs are not happy because of some um deceptiveness that has transpired okay so i see um some deceptiveness that has to do um with money um for some of you and here it's it's just lies and deceptiveness all around whatever is transpiring lies and deceptiveness all around and it has to do with a business a project it has to do with that so it says you it could be at work it could be something that you're um partnering up with and people are not being honest and you fire sign are feeling this okay 
all right you fire sign are feeling this so definitely i see you fire sign are not really happy with some situation that is going on you have regrets because of the deceptiveness uh, um that has happened and has transpired okay the the secrets are coming out about what had transpired um exactly the secrets are going to be coming out because there is so much information people aren't speaking the truth um so much information and people aren't speaking the truth and that's it i am not seeing a victory for you guys okay i'm not seeing a victory overcoming a situation um i see you end up where um i i, I see your partner your partner is going to be there for you your soulmate your twin flame is going to be there for you um this person is definitely going to be standing by you okay um in whatever shape or form i see you are so saddened by something because you some of you can't believe that you know it could be people that you have hung out with why would people be um like just so driven and have so much uh, dismay you know and and you're like i've always been good to these people so um and and you know ladies and gentlemen i've learned in the years um it is it's not people are not mm -mm. people are not mm -mm. So fire sign this month is going to be a month so um what's coming out for the fire sign let's see so what is happening fire sign is that whatever this issue and the situation is some of you were in some hardship and i see you're going to be receiving a new start you have sadness so much sadness and you were in some hardship and i see you are going to be definitely having a new start you will receive some money that is going to be giving you a new start you will receive some money um that will help you to move you forward if some of you um were living with family i see that you're going to be receive some extra money so that you and your family can find your own place to live I, okay and you yes definitely i said it definitely okay so um whatever is transpiring i see that you and your family is going to be receiving some help i see a new start here with um um a pisces cancer a scorpion 50 years and older i see a new start with this person um and uh, um uh this is uh, uh definitely a new start is coming up with this person i see you're going to be finding out the truth about some um some money um i you're gonna be it's like um you're gonna be finding out the truth what exactly happened to that money and where did that money go okay i see that you're going to be um you men whatever is transpiring you men and you businessmen have a lot of regrets you men and businessmen are going to be in a hard place between an hard place and a rock and you have a lot of regrets okay um i see that taurus but uh, or um help could be coming in all right so some of you help could be coming in but i see that some of you would have gotten help from a taurus but you have led this person um down the the, the wrong rabbit hole and i see that this person is stepping away and backing up I see a judgment call a judgment call is coming up because they have found out some deceptive situation as the as transpire a judgment call is coming up um um and whatever this judgment call is coming up on it is some secret and deceptiveness that was created i see you're going to have justice you're definitely going to be having justice you're going to be having justice um hover and aquarian and some secrets because the truth is going to be coming out you're going to definitely going to be having some justice over a gemini and a scorpion because some secret is going to be coming up okay 
now I see a transition the end of the secrets whatever is transpiring transition the end of the secret the transition the end of the secrets because I see the secret came out about what happened I see some of you could have a new start however this is going some of you could have a new start so um, it will happen and it depends some of your baby could be born um definitely um yeah some of you your baby could come um earlier than normal because this is definitely a baby um um I see you men have a lot of regrets I see some of you men want a new start with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion but um it's not going to happen because this person they don't want it to happen okay i see the truth about some deceptiveness and some money is going to be coming out and i see justice is really um coming in because they found out what exactly had transpired i see some of you are dealing with issues in organization institution okay i see you're really dealing with some issues in and these corporation and you're realizing um that not all is well like some of you had i i hopes or high you you look at government institutes and organization with i you know i respect these people and now some of you are, are going to be thinking yeah so i see a situation where as i said um some of you are going to be having a baby um this baby is going to be um really really coming um premature premature so let me know what is going on because i see that this baby is going to be coming premature okay and whatever is transpiring um i see um you guys you young people i see you're going to be meeting a twin flame or a soulmate so um as you come to the end of the month you might be meeting a twin flame or a soulmate some of you might be having issues oh yeah some of you are definitely going to be meeting a twin flame or a soulmate um, some of you might receive the connection um, with a corporation institution a new contract okay so um, if you were looking for a job I see a new contract is going to be coming in with a corporation institution and I see here um, an offer is going to be offered an offer of love and this is from a uh, um, um, this is from a twin flame and a soulmate so offer of love is going to be coming in from a twin flame and a soulmate and this is absolutely um good so um yeah um men some of you businessmen there is really um really some injustice with a situation um i see judgment call because a lot of secret is going to be coming out as you come in the third week so the first week is a week of the night and and the week thereafter and then you count the third week so i see truths i see truths are about a whole lot of stuff is coming out so be aware of this okay and um Whatever it is it, I see a whole lot of information is going to be coming out. And some of you are going to be finding out things that you weren't aware of. All right. 
okay so let's 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 go let's go let's go let's go let's see what's coming up So, fire signs, you have the first house for the Aries, the second, the fifth house for the Leas, and the ninth house for the Sagittarian, the twelfth house for, for um, the Ophiosis. So the Ophiosis, remember um, that you are a, a healer, okay? So let's see what is going on. So in the first house of self and the first house is the house of Aries. Okay. I see communication, communication um, with um, communication falls on. Um, there's a lot of communication between you and your partner, air sign, whatever is transpiring, you and your marriage, you and your husband um yeah um there has to be some communication aries i see you're having some conflicts some inner conflicts um aries i'm seeing that there is some situation you can't understand because the queen cox is there and you're having inner conflicts with yourself and certain issues in certain situation money the flow is good the flow of um your money is going to be good so there is no question about that fire sign. I see some of you are going to be realizing that where you are is where you were meant to be. So stay put, um, whether it's work, whether it's uh, where you live, stay put because that there is where you were meant to be. I see semi sex style of families, opportunities, new um, and opportunities are going to be coming in for families. This is um, definitely happening. I see the energy of the North Node that some of you are going to be meeting people and connecting with people and you feel, yeah, this feels like home. Do you know what, like when you um, really connect to people and um, you, you feel, yes, these are the people that I, um, these are the people that really make me feel like home. That is what is going to be happening. I see the energy of the moon and the energy of the moon is some emotional situation with your environment so some of you um in this four weeks could feel emotional on the work floor could feel very emotion very emotion it's as if um some of your healing emotional um things and uh, um if you have done um like a courses with me and that sort of a thing and you're going deep and healing emotional stuff then you can just cry at any moment spontaneously crying because you're releasing the pain of the soul okay so i i don't know if any one of you have ever done that with me but that's what um that's how i work with people and it's so amazing because um you will have like four weeks if you work like six weeks with me um some um six weeks or eight weeks you spontaneous just start to cry just spontaneously start to cry because you go deep to heal um emotional um stuff so um whatever is happening i see um relationships is good um whatever the relationship is it is good contracts are good relationships are good i see luck in um relationship and new contracts okay i see love in the ninth house so i see some of you are going to be learning things new things because when love comes up it's about learning new things it's about understanding it's about going deeper it's it's about connecting um and really really um feeling so connected um because you're 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 healing um you're looking for information to heal yourself and this is good in the ninth hour so 
unexpected breakthroughs and uh, um whatever is transpiring unexpected breakthroughs that is going to be um healing your reputation so however this is happening i see some unexpected breakthrough that is going to be healing the reputation so as i look in sagittarius it's all about love okay sagittarius it's all about love um leo it is all about finding your true north okay um it's about connecting with yourself and knowing who you are um and being connected with yourself but also the people who you're connected with yourself is a positive the energy of uh, love is here for you sagittarian so however that is coming up a new love because i said new love was going to come in now i see a healing in the 11th house so i saw um the 11th house is the house where you come to an edge with something and whatever this emotional thing is you're broken you're broken it's as if uh, this thing has broken you that uh, you have come to the edge with this thing and it's as if some of you are going to say i don't want to do anything i don't want to connect to with anyone i don't want to you know do anything with anyone because uh, how can people be so mean and evil and fire signs i'm going to tell you this you will get from this position okay but you will never trust again you will get back on your feet and get from this position but you will never ever trust again so remember that i see conjunction conjunction of empowerment so i see at this time and this is going to be a good time for you fire sign people to heal the situation so whatever is happening and transpiring this is going to be a very good time to heal a situation and heal whatever is transpiring okay so i see the energy of conjunction that is happening and conjunction that is coming up for you and it's about you um um guys healing certain aspects and certain situations and this is going to be absolutely fabulous this is just going to be good it's going to be absolutely fabulous okay um really really um fabulous okay so um that is good now i see some of you um in the first house is dealing with a cancer whatever the issue and the situation is with the cancer you could be taking on the nurturing energies too for some of you but for some of you i see that uh, um the aquarians because this is your house you're really having an issue with a cancer okay and whatever it's, it's it, this issue is it's like this cancer make things more complex for you sagittarian and you can't figure it out and it's as if the cancer is really doing it so it could be your husband it could be your wife and you're like hold on this is too complex because this person really do this so that i can't know what i'm doing and i see you're going to be finding out um away in these four weeks because it's like this person it could be a partner that is creating so many illusions that you can't see clearly anymore so be aware of that okay um aries um oh then in the house of money section i see some of you are dealing with an Aquarian whoever this Aquarian is whatever this is transpiring with this Aquarian I see that some of you um, there was an issue with an Aquarian could have gotten you in some um, financial um, situation that could have caused you a cause um, a decrease or increase in your um, financial situation so um, it depends on who you are and what is happening now i see um the situation with the environment i see some of you whatever is transpiring in the environment um 
there is the energy of your boss whatever is transpiring with you and your boss because this has to do with a boss um i think for now um stay put okay uh stay put so um because this is about um work and 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 uh, resident work and career stay put okay it has to do with a boss stay put then we have um some issue that is going to be balancing out and i see a libran in a family is going to be helping things to go smoother and balancing out things okay so whoever this liberant is and whatever is transpiring i see this libra that is connected to your family is going to try to bring some balance in the family okay it's definitely going to bring some balance in the family uh north node i see some of you are dealing with a gemini whoever this gemini is and whatever is transpiring um the energy with this gemini um i see you are really dealing with an issue and a situation with a gemini and some of you are finding especially you leos are finding that this gemini is your no node it's like this gemini is showing you because this um is your house and you're dealing with the north node for the rest of you i see some of you dealing with this gemini as friends okay and um it's like you know this person is okay and that is true um, the moon, I see, um, some of you are dealing, uh, you Aries, there is a lot of, um, psychic emotional situation that is going on with you Aries. Um, the energy of the moon. So you know what comes with the moons? There's a lot of feelings, a lot of emotions that is going on in the sixth house, the sixth house of work the six hours of the everyday there is a lot of emotional that is coming up for you Aries whatever is transpiring with you Aries um there is a lot of emotions that is coming in your your everyday it's as if you're not happy at your work or you're not happy at home you're not happy at your work or you're not happy in the environment that you are I see um, if you're in a relationship with a scorpion, if a scorpion, I see some sort of a scorpion energy that some of you are having in your relationship. Now, scorpion energy is secrecy, not saying what exactly is happening, creating illusions. Okay. Um, people trying to, um, like you're saying something to your partner and then uh, they're going to say yeah and what about you and you're like really that's like a scorpion energy um comparing and that sort of a thing so i see that coming up with communication okay virgos whatever is transpiring i see a lot of you um are having an affair with virgos um yeah a lot of you are having an affair with virgos are going to be having a contract with a virgo um, however, this is transpiring. Some of you could be um, getting in a relationship with a Virgo, but I see this Virgo could also be a sibling. Whoever the sibling is, I see, um, yeah, this Virgo could be a sibling also. Okay, so um, be aware of that. All right. Saji, um, I see um, some of you, um, Saji, um, you fall in your own house. Oh my God. There's a lot of love in this house for you, Sagittarius. So the Sagittarius fall in their own house. To love yourself, Saggy. Whatever is transpiring and happening, Sagittarius, you're going to be learning to love yourself. Okay? You're definitely going to be learning to love yourself. It's all about love, Saggy. And I see you, um, you fall in your own house, and this is going to be good. So, Sagittarius, it's all about you um reclaiming yourself loving yourself and knowing that you know whatever is transpiring um you can love yourself okay so i see unexpected situation with a pisces in your reputation so um however is it that a pisces is going to be helping to heal your uh, reputation i think so so whatever is happening and transpiring i see whoever the spices is they're they're going to be trying to heal your reputation so whatever transpire with you scorpion i see um with your fire sign i see a pisces is going to be coming in 
unexpectedly helping you guys to heal your reputation Leah's I see a healing I see you come to the edge and uh, whatever is transpiring Leo's you have come to the edge you're giving up okay you have come to the edge you're giving up you honestly realize that it is better okay and in the long run you will see that letting go is going to be better for you because it's like when yeah it's like letting go it's like you're not gonna fight whatever the issue or the situation anymore you're just gonna let go and 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 healing is here Leo so it is good let go and let God that is the saying and I see that where you are at this moment if you try to fight this thing or go forward or push or shove it's not gonna help and do any better so let it go so I see you you Leo's are going to be coming in for an healing and um that is going to be happening now ophiosis in your house you are dealing with the tauruses and i see conjunction of empowerment so the 12th house for you guys is the 12th house of forgiveness um forgiving um you know helping and looking back at what has transpired so um yeah it's all about forgiving it's all about you guys uh, really connecting on a higher level to understand that forgiveness is the key okay forgiveness is a key and I see some of you are just going to re realize that you know maybe I was at fault whether I was at fault the person was at fault forgiveness is the key I just don't want to do this anymore okay so it's, it's, it's as if you're just gonna be accepting accepting and then by forgiving yourself and forgiving others you empower yourself okay forgiving yourself and giving others you empower yourself so fire sign um that was it very beautiful enjoy 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 and don't forget join the channel subscribe and notification i love you guys namaste